Today I've got another Amazon customer turned gigantic mystery box that weighs 32 pounds. So this is full of general merchandise, which is what I refer to as hodgepodge. It could be a little bit of everything. It could be electronics, toys, housewares, home goods, sporting goods, tools. You dream it, it could be in it. So my price on these around $250 a piece. Return on value is between three to four times your money back. Crazy fantastic value. Yeah, I'm loving these new boxes that I'm getting for liquidations, and they are craziness. Awesome value, extremely profitable, and they're a lot of fun to open up because everything's total mystery, nothing's manifested. Here we go. Hopefully, this one, come on, knife. Hopefully, this one's gonna be awesome. These are, like I said, these are a lot of fun. I really enjoy these. Oh, oh, okay. <laughs> we have a pop on top. There we go. That's what we're seeing in this box. Oh. That was just a phone case. So, not crazy expensive. It is, the brand is Spec, S-P-E-C-K. Most of those cases are about 10 bucks or so. So go ahead, start the total off with the cases on the floor. Here we go, first item out of the box, we have an absolute crushed, mangled Funko Pop. We have Bill Lumberg from Office Space, but he's destroyed. It's a goner, this box is done. Done, done, done. So, not, there's no value there, there's no value. Here we go, we got some brand new socks. Men's size six to eight, women's size six through 10, some brand new Nike socks. Let me scan the Amazon app. Most prices I'm gonna get them from eBay, Soul, but these will be quick just to scan the Amazon seller app, so much as things actually sell for. Quick gauge. And they sell on Amazon for 14 bucks. Okay, so eBay, about $10 or so. Ooh, what's this, what's this, what's this? Wireless car charger. Oh, it's just a wireless car charger. You can hook this onto like your uh, your vent or something and you can use it as a mount in a car charger. Oh, 10, 15 bucks. Not crazy expensive. We have a Timex watch. What do we have here? Ooh, okay. Looks like we have a like new condition watch. Timex. Don't know if it's ever been used or not, but it is a Timex Iron Man watch. The barcode's covered up. I don't see a model number on it. But most Timex watches, what are they? Maybe 25, 30 bucks. Just guesstimating price, 25, 30 bucks, I bet. That could be low. But we're just saying like 25, 30 bucks. We have a table holder for the Echo Dot fourth generation. Not crazy expensive on that. We need some expensive stuff. Okay, here's. <laughs> we have the Golden Girls, the complete first season three disc set. This looks kind of bootleggish. They never released a box set like this, like wrapped up like this. And the front covers look very pixelated. Like very pixelated. So I think this is an actual bootleg uh, Golden Girls collection. I don't think this is authentic. I think this is the bootleg of the Golden Girls. I had to do more research on this, but yeah, I. I've never seen the Golden Girls sell their set like this and just with that cover. And like it's still like factory sealed, but those covers on this thing just look really pixelated. And if you've run into counterfeit DVDs and Blu-rays in, in, in the past, you can usually tell by just the covers. And yeah, that that lo looks bootleggish. Hopefully it's not, but I think it is. We got a video converter. No brand, just video converter. Probably, you know, 10, 15 bucks. 
Oh, we have a vehicle scanner. That could be some good value. I have no idea on this item. Well, it's, all, it's all still factory wrapped up. Let's see if I can find some value on this. So on eBay, 35 to 40 bucks for this item. Not bad, not bad. I'll take that. We have a power inverter. I've had this thing before, and it's around $20, $25. There it is. $20, bucks. Waiting for those something crazy expensive to come out of this box. Because usually these boxes have something like crazy expensive in them. Dog training collar. It's all in there. I have no idea how much this is worth. There's got to be some crazy in this box. There's always something of a crazy value in these boxes. At least like one thing. A knife. It's got to be in there somewhere. Everybody's like, stop peeking. I'm not peeking. <laughs> let's look this up. Okay, so this sells new for 20 to 25 bucks in that range for the dog training collar. We have a DeWalt car charger. Five, 10 bucks on that. Wireless presenter. I've had this before in these boxes. That's like 15 bucks or so. Not crazy expensive, but it'll sell. We have a brand new factory sealed knife. The brand is Jealous, J-E-L-L-A-S folding knife. That's what it looks like. If you can see it on camera, hopefully you can. I'm gonna keep it sealed. Let me see how well this what this brand sells for. I'm not too familiar with the brand Jealous. Ah, uh, it sells for like 10 bucks. <laughs> Cheaper knife. Oh, we have a Chi. Chi volumizer blowout brush. Some of this cheese stuff can be expensive, I know. Hopefully this is a good a good one. Some of this cheese stuff can be kind of pricey. It's in there. It's like all bubble wrapped up. Fingers crossed, the cheese is good. Hopefully the cheese is good. Looks like this on eBay, open box, a pre-owned condition. It's between like 25 to 50. We'll kind of do it in the middle, like $40. Best offer, you know, 40-ish. We have a, a Benzomatic High Heat Torch. High Heat Torch Benzomatic. Have no clue. I'm like very curious of what is my high-end item in this box. It's in here somewhere. I haven't found it yet. It's driving me freaking crazy. What is my high-end item? Oh, there's Michael Kors watch. We'll do, we'll do, do that next, actually. There's something that's like poly bagged in there. Let's look this up first though. Wow, this thing, is this thing still factory? It is, it's still factory sealed. This thing sells new for like between 40 and 60 bucks. 50 bucks, right down the middle. Right down the middle. Here we go, Michael Coors watch. Okay, ooh, hopefully this is a good one. This might be my home run item. It's like a rose gold color. The entire watch is still wrapped up with that pr the protective film. The watch face is all wrapped up. Yeah, this thing has not even been unwrapped from its factory like seal yet. They have it so it doesn't get scratched. I'm gonna, I'm gonna look on Amazon, see how much they sell for on Amazon. Whoa. Maybe my, it'll focus on it. It says Amazon is $259 on Amazon. Be very careful with this watch, Clint. Do not let the protective film come off of that band. Keep that thing all factory packaged up. Okay, that's nice. That's expensive. So it's a tag attached to it and everything. Whew, let's look on eBay sold prices. It's so looking on eBay for the Rose Gold Watch. 105, 95, 98, 115. On average, on eBay, of course, on Amazon it's sold new for $259, but that's Amazon. Prices are much different on Amazon usually. But on eBay, it's like a hundred bucks right here. Next item, smart Wi-Fi garage door opener. I still have factory package. I'm just gonna keep it factory package. That watch was crazy value. It is kind of crazy that it sells for twice as much on Amazon does on eBay, but still, that was a hundred dollar watch. About twenty five bucks for the smart, um, what are those things called? Garage opener thing. Ooh, what is this? Radio Oddity Car Mobile Radio. People, I guess, people still use these in their vehicle? 
Oh, that's still brand new. It says all the film attached to it. Let me put it right back in the way I got it. That's still new. I have no idea value of like uh, mobile radios for your vehicle. I haven't sold one of these for a long time. Ooh, this is expensive. I had no idea they sold for that much. So on eBay, in new condition, it sold for 120 bucks, 110 bucks, 110 bucks, 125. I'm gonna ask 125 for this. Nice. So these two things right here pretty much pay for the entire box. Those two items. Nice. So I found two of my high-end items in this box. We have an audio streaming boss audio systems, a marine gauge. Is that good? That's what it looks like. Am I finding the higher end stuff now? I think I am. Bose, oh, that thing is still all factory wrapped up down there. Keep it in the box. Don't take it out. Just keep it there. I think the good stuff in this box was in the bottom of the box. Ooh, this is expensive. If this is, I'm about to check it out very close, but if it's like brand new, it sells for 150. If it's open box item, like, you know, maybe test it out one time or something, it's between like 80 to 120. So if it's like new condition, it's as high as 150, we'll just go with, with, with like the 125 price point. That's kind of expensive right there also. We're getting the expensive stuff now. We have, not sure what this is. Oh, high definition binoculars. This is kind of like a spotting scope. It has a carrying case for it and everything. So it sells between 40 and 50 bucks for that, but still that's a good item. I'll take it. Oh, we have a Boss Audio Systems Riot. Oh, we got an amplifier. <laughs> We're getting all the good stuff now. The first half of this box was like, eh, you know, 20, 25, 15. Oh, that's still all factory packaged up in there. We'll just leave it right there in the box. See, I told you this box somewhere was the good stuff. I just had to find it. And I found it. We're getting like good stuff back to back to back to back. So this was not crazy expensive. 35 to 50 bucks. 40. We'll say 40. We have a wall home products. Probably gonna be like a beer trimmer or something. Nice carrying case. Yeah, it's a beer trimmer. Okay. So probably 20, 25 bucks. Nothing crazy there. I've sold dozens and dozens of these over the years, like the wall trimmers. Let's see, we have Fox and Falcon monoculars. Kind of like the other brand we had earlier, just a few minutes ago. So what was that? What was that, like 35, 40 bucks? This will be probably about the same range as those. About the same. Let's open up this thing. It's been staring at me. It's factory, not factory, but it's in a poly bag. Crack open this poly bag, see what's in it. Oh, we've had these before. Yep, these are the front and rear sights for a rifle. The uh, Magpul MOE Imbus. Look, look these up on Amazon. It'll be much, much quicker. Yeah, I found them on Amazon. These sell new on Amazon for $83 for the front and rear sights together. $83. So on eBay, maybe $75 plus shipping. So... I'm pretty sure these are already listed in our eBay store. Pretty sure it is. Our eBay store, our direct link is down below in the description box to this video. Um, the eBay store, as of whenever you watch this, the eBay store is turned off where you can't buy anything until after Christmas. Because I always turn off my eBay store like two weeks before Christmas because the Christmas madness, packages getting lost, packages getting delayed, packages taking two to three weeks to go like a, like a state over. So I always turn off my eBay store about two weeks before Christmas. I just turn it off. It's turned off. You can't buy anything. It gets turned on Christmas day like at midnight or something like that. So I don't think you can actually see anything right now. It depends on whenever you watch this video too. My eBay store will be active on December 25th again. You, you'll be able to see like 1500 listings for sale all over again tac life factory sealed box 
But yeah, there is a direct link below in the, in the description box of the video to the eBay store to check it out. But like I said, if you can't see anything, check back on Christmas Day and it'll be turned back on active again. I turn it off just for peace of mind because people get crazy over Christmas time. Some customers can be very, very non-understanding about issues that are not my fault when it comes to shipping. You know what I'm talking about. USPS over Christmas time, packages take weeks to get delivered and a lot of them get lost in the mail. So I just turn my whole store off. <laughs> Nothing's for sale for a few weeks. This sells brand new for around 50 bucks and it is still factory sealed. So that one is brand new. Got a few things left, actually two things left. Ooh, what's this? Auto tool. Auto tool car inclinometer or something? No clue. I'm, I'm not a car person. I don't really know much about vehicles. Oh, it is a smart GPS slop meter. Is that expensive? It's probably all factory packaged up too, I bet. Yeah, I was gonna I was gonna keep it in there. So I'll just show you the picture on the front again. That's what it looks like. This might be expensive. Automotive stuff can be crazy prices sometimes. Yeah, I'm looking on eBay right now. I'm seeing 80, 82, 75, 70. 75 bucks. Another fantastic item in this box. Another like $75 item. <laughs> we got one thing left. This is it, last item. We have a home cell phone signal a booster kit. It's like this, oh, this is used. It has, it's all, it's all scratched up. This is not new. So probably not crazy value on this item. So on eBay used, it's around 30 to $40. We'll do 35 bucks on this item. So that is it for this box. The first half of the box was going pretty slowly, but the last half of this box was a freaking home run. Craziness came out of this box. So once again, this is going to be extremely profitable. It was a lot of fun. I love these kind of liquidation boxes because it's it's good stuff in it. It's really good stuff. Everything here is super sellable. It's going to be profitable, and it makes for a really fun YouTube video, I think. So hopefully you enjoyed it. If you haven't already, go down below and hit that subscribe button because I upload every single day. Have not missed an upload in over three years now. So I'll see you again tomorrow on this YouTube channel.